Uh, Manny, you've taken a lot of slack from the boys recently, but in games you've held your own and you've definitely been an integral part of the outstanding defence that you have had since the, the turn of the new year. Um, as a fullback, you bomb up and down a lot down that right hand side. How important is fitness in that role? As you said there, sure enough, the whole team went through a bad patch. Um, maybe 11, 12 games beaten. But um, you're going to get that in football, you're going to get your ups and downs. And uh, as you say, you have to be fitter. I'd like to get fitter as a fullback and maybe get up and down a bit more to help out the attack as well as the fence. But um, it also comes from your winger. Winger gets up and down, help you, and you get up and down, help them. So it definitely it's, it's a positive if you have a winger in front of you to help you. Definitely. Um, over the whole year, your crosses have been very consistent, more so than Ashley Young. Um, is it something you work on in training? <coughs> I well, if we as a player there, he sets up great drills all the time in training. Most of our drills are based on you know getting the ball from centre right wide as quick as possible, get it to the wingers, get it to the fullbacks, and get the ball in the box to like Zayanet and like Dylan. So it most mo mainly comes from training. Like, and if you, the more you do it in training, the more it happens in a match. So. Definitely. Um, last question from me. Um, you were over at West Brom for a period of time. What was that experience like and how do you think that moulded you into the player you are today? Well, when you go across to England as a young boy, like, it's, it's a dream. But when you go over there, you have, you have many different opponents, many different nationalities against you. And, and you just keep learning day by day, you train every day, different coaches, different types of play. So the more you learn over there, you can bring it back here and bring it into the style of football as we do, more quicker and, and more physical, so that's really it. Like. I know worries, I'm going to hand over to Andy Vance now for some quick fire questions. Yes, yeah, it's Manny Evo. Something like that. <laughs> right, Manny, best trainer? Gareth Doherty. Worst trainer? <clears throat> um, Jesus, that's me. Most intelligent? Oh, a few boys, I would say Adam McKellen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Least intelligent? Matty Kerr. Quickest? Mm, yourself or the folly, I would say. Slowest? Liam Burns. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> Holy cow. <laughs> <Burns. laughs> Hard man. Um, Canty. Very uh, Biggest joker? Probably yourself, I would say. Yeah. Biggest motor? Yourself again. <laughs> Shocking. <laughs> Worst first touch? Uh, yourself again. <laughs> <laughs> Most skillful? Um, uh, I would say Matty Kirk, uh, uh, Best player you've played with at the club? There's been a few. I would say outstanding this year, Lee McNulty. Yeah. Unsung hero at the club? Kenny Ramsey. Number one supporter, definitely. Manager's favourite said? Um, well done, Emma. Has to be. <laughs> Manager's pet? Emma. Definitely. <Yeah. laughs> Uh, worst dress sets? Oof, there's a few, there's definitely a few. Um, I would say big dull neck and we have trainers <laughs> uh, Best dress sets? Oh fuck. There's not many well dressed, hey? Um, I don't want I'd them. say cheesy. Uh, least likely to buy a pint. Ooh, well, apart from yourself. I would say a cheesy game. Uh, <laughs> uh, best thing about Derby Football Club, buddy. Since I've came, it's definitely been the fans. We've been through a horrible patch there this season, even and you know even today you'll see the fans up here in numbers. So I'd say the fans definitely. Very good, very good. Thank you very much. That's a wrap. Yeah. Yeah, and all the fans all the results as well go around this because obviously we're two points clear of pace and I, but we're level we're not pretty next. So. The fans results go around this at the same time.
Your reflection in my wine glass That's when I look away Can't stand and think about losing your fine ass How the fuck I let you slip away Life for the party but I'm dead inside Kill my vibes, it was genocide Hard to act like I've been alive I'm trying to find where I identify One time for the girl that got away Two times for the bub I'm about to spray Three times for the power that I pray to Are you up there? Can you hear me? I know I fucked up it's clear, see, I'm 22, but I don't act like it clearly <laughs> And all this shit is a mirage I'm just rapping for a cause The life, the fame, the lights, the game We break the laws, don't like to change Wanna win you back, but I hate to lose I know that you're the one, but it's hard yeah, to choose Change once some fame hit Make it up, take you down Have a shot, I'll bout around Play my song, you like the sound It's going down, it's going down Let's drink coffee, watch passerbys And prove to you I'm not the average guy It's just my flaws that they magnify And when it's real, you don't have to try Oh, here we ever got 
hat, uh, hat trick hero today for Dorkview, uh, Alan. How did the game go? I won three points in the end thing, but leaving the pitch today, three points was obviously a victory. And after getting three goals, which is uh, a bonus for me, but it's all about the team with three points on the go. Definitely. I'll just put you in the back ball here. Cheers. Congratulations. Good man. Good man.